Hello guys, it's Ocean by Nature and today's video is about how to update your BIOS version of your video card XFX R9 280X. First of all, if you go to the uh, XFX website, website, you can see that there are actually two versions of this video card. The first one is Double Dissipation and the second one is Double Dissipation Black Edition. The only differences between those two are just uh, the second one is uh, a little bit overclocked than the, uh, the first one. First, I can tell you that there are actually two BIOS versions for the first Double Dissipation Edition and there is only one version of the, uh, the BIOS for the Black Edition. So you can actually go from the Black Edition, uh, from the Double Dissipation Edition to Black Edition. So if you, if you go to the uh, website that I've included in the description of this video, you can see that there are three versions of the, of the BIOSes. Uh, the first one is the one that uh, probably most of you uh, guys have, if you have a double dissipation edition. The second one is, a, is an update of this BIOS. And the third one is the only BIOS version of a black edition. So you can go from uh, double dissipation uh, to updated double dissipation BIOS version or you can grow from double dissipation to double dissipation black edition. Right now is the moment to give you a warning that doing this is at your own risk. Uh, you can actually break your video card or damage uh, the hardware by, you, by doing this. So only do it if you know what you are doing actually. You can use a GPU Z software which I will include also in the, in the description of this video. In this section, BIOS version. There is some numbers here that can tell you which version that you already have. If you see right now, I already have the, the first BIOS version, which is actually from the September of this year. And this is the first BIOS version of, uh, of uh, this series. Uh, I've already updated to the, to the Black Edition, but reverted back for some testing. For example, I will download this version of, uh, of the BIOS that I have for right here. Then. To be able to update it to the latest one, I will use a software called 80 WinFlash, which also I will include uh, a link in the description of this video. By um, you, you can update the video card by loading the image. Just choose the image that you you've already downloaded, this one, and then choose program and save. And that's about it. Uh, of course. Before doing all of those stuff, the first thing that you should do is to actually make a backup of your existing BIOS. Uh, this way, you, if something happens to, to your video card, this way you can revert back to, to your original BIOS version. Uh, doing this is just again using uh, GPU Z. So before you make any uh, updates of your BIOS, just click this button and click save to file. Then click, uh, okay, let's choose somewhere to download it. Just, just click save and you will have the BIOS version of your, uh, you have the current BIOS version of your video card. This way you can actually revert back to it in the future if you manage to actually screw something up. Of course, if you cannot, mm, <coughs> sorry, if you cannot boot into Windows because you've mm, messed up your video card, uh, probably the best way is to actually uh, create a bootable USB drive into DOS, and then use. Uh, you can actually use uh, the same AT WinFlash um, software but it has a cmd uh, program that you can use uh, to update your bios without going into windows um, i hope that this video is useful to you so if you liked it please give us a rating and have a nice day